wait a second, I've got my glasses on and I'm having a fag in a holder. Um, uh, yeah, dusk is coming and I've forgotten, you know, um, I, I'd never lived without electric before and because uh, I, I, I've had a very privileged life really and the bailiffs when they came in, there were seven of them, two for the gas because obviously it was a mains gas supply for a factory and uh, the electric, the bailiff, a policeman, <laughs> um, yeah, I, I don't know if anybody's ever gone through that, but it's, um, <clears throat> yeah, it's very difficult. And for three weeks, uh, whenever I went near a light switch, I'd turn it on, but it wouldn't work. And obviously I had no experience of camping or anything, so people around here were very sweet. They gave me start, gave me a few bits, and I got some gas. And But when the f gas canister ran out in my light... Um, I didn't know how to put the new canister in and I forced it and it exploded. Well, the gas came out and went on a candle and it burnt all my, the top part of my body. So that was 10 years ago. It's recovered now. Well, it, it didn't take that long, but I went, I was, it was August and it was hot and I had no top on. So it took all the hair off my chest and my eyebrows and uh, it's not much left on my head anyway. That's another story. I'll tell you about that another time anyway. Uh, I'm just waiting for the light to go down because I want to show you something. Okay, bye. <laughs>